Hi, my name's Kerry Badham and today I'm delighted to introduce to you our brand new adorable baby set. It's on a large tappet, which is very easy to use. It's great because you don't lose any of the pieces. And now I'm going to show you the four designs that's included on the adorable baby set. We have a very cute crawling baby. We have a baby in a pram, baby in a blanket, and we have the stalk. The paste we recommend that you use to make these motifs is a modelling paste. You can buy modelling paste, but you can also make it. You use a simple fondant and you add to it a Tylo. You may also see it called Tylo's CMC or Gumtrag. I put a little bit on my mat and I add it to the small amount that I want to use. You can make up 250 grams of this by adding a quarter of a teaspoon or you can just make it up as you go along which is what I prefer to do, that way I have no waste. You can wrap it in clean film and keep it in an airtight container. This is a thickener, it makes your paste easier to handle. That way you don't cause as much damage and it's not so floppy and you will actually feel it firming up as you make it. So I would now put this to one side and leave it for approximately 30 minutes at least but making it the night before is really good because then you're all ready to go. We have used a few different colours on our motifs so you would need to make up each colour in advance. I'm going to demonstrate how you can make a cupcake topper now and these are really easy to use they're great for beginners because they're nice and simple but they're also great for professionals um, they're very good because they go right across all the different celebrations baby naming your christenings baptisms um, new baby baby showers or even a young baby's birthday cake first of all i've cut out a top for my cupcake now ideally you would cut it out and you would leave it to dry so it's nice and firm and i've made that using the bowen scallop cupcake cutter from the fmm range i rolled out my modeling paste and I literally cut it out. So you would do that and you would leave it to dry but for the purpose of the video we're going to use it how it is. I've also rolled out some pink modeling paste and some white modeling paste using a non-stick rolling pin. I've allowed it to dry off a little. This puts a nice dry edge on top and it will stop it from sticking in your cutter. So if we start with the, the pram, place the tappet on top of your modelling paste, apply pressure with your hand and slide it around the mat. Turn it over and lightly emboss with your fingers. You can see here where I didn't quite apply enough pressure just for the wheels. I'm going to do that again. Remove the excess and if you get any stick in any of the other parts of the tap it, just pick it out and then you tap it. If you want to, you can also use a dry brush to push it through. It's entirely up to you. And they're very nice and easy we have our baby sitting in a pram. But the nice thing about these is that we can do the different pieces in different colors if we want to. So I'm actually just going to use the white, which I'm going to use for the wheels and the baby's head, just to show you how you can easily create a quick contrast to add some extra detail to your cupcake topper without making it too difficult. So I've just put the wheels on the fondant those out and then the baby's head pull it round again 
slide it around your mat, remove the excess. It's actually coming out really easy out of the cutter. So now we're going to attach it to the top of our cupcake topper. And I'm just using some water here. You can use edible glue if you want to, but you don't need to. So pop that on top. And then what you can do is, if you wanted to, you could just cut out the inner section of the wheel, or you can just place it on top completely. And then the baby's head. As you'll see on the one I made earlier, we've got some baby's eyes and I use the Rainbow Dust edible pen just to pop two little dots on there. I'm sure you'll agree this is a fantastic addition to your cake decorating tool set and we hope you enjoy using the adorable baby set.